Ever wondered if that morning cup of coffee could turn into an addiction? Well, let's dive in. Caffeine, found in our beloved coffee, tea, and even chocolate, is a popular stimulant consumed by billions worldwide. It's the quick fix for a groggy morning or an afternoon slump, providing that much-needed energy boost. But here's where things get interesting. Just as with any other stimulant, the concept of caffeine addiction is not far-fetched. Regular consumption can lead to a certain level of dependence. You might notice that skipping that usual cup of joe leads to headaches, fatigue, or even irritability. These are withdrawal symptoms, an indication that your body has become accustomed to its daily caffeine fix. So to answer the question at hand, yes, caffeine addiction is indeed a real thing. The body's response to regular caffeine intake and its reaction when deprived of it is a clear indicator. But is it necessarily a bad thing? Well, stay tuned to find out. Like most things in life, caffeine consumption has its pros and cons. Let's start with the upsides. Caffeine, a stimulant found in coffee, tea, and even chocolate, can give you a real kick when you need it. It's the morning jolt that helps you shake off the sleep cobwebs, and the afternoon pick-me-up that gets you through that last stretch of work. Studies show that caffeine can enhance alertness, improve cognitive performance, and even boost physical endurance. It's no wonder that it's the world's most widely consumed psychoactive substance. But, like a coin, there's another side to this story. While caffeine can be a great ally, it can also be a formidable foe. High intake can lead to insomnia, making those sweet dreams a bit elusive, it can cause jitteriness, turning your calm into chaos. And let's not forget that it can increase your heart rate, giving your ticker an unnecessary workout. Now here's where the plot thickens. Not everyone reacts to caffeine in the same way. Some can down a double espresso after dinner and still sleep like a baby, while others might find themselves wide awake from a late afternoon cup of tea. This variation is due to individual tolerance and response to caffeine, which can be influenced by factors like genetics and regularity of consumption. So, it's clear that caffeine consumption has both its benefits and drawbacks, and these can vary from person to person. In conclusion, caffeine addiction is indeed a real concern, but it's not necessarily a cause for panic. We've explored the pros and cons, highlighting that caffeine in moderation can have benefits. However, overconsumption can lead to health issues. It's all about balance and being mindful of your intake. Remember, too much of anything is rarely a good idea. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. Thank you for watching.